That is uh, where we start uh, this hour. The Khoisan communities in the Northern Cape say they are still hopeful that their languages will become one of the official ones in the future. There's been some progress, but they admit a lot still needs to be done. International Mother Language Day is being celebrated today. Languages have survived the ages. Many are thousands of years old. Now marginalized. The Tung and Kwe communities at Plattfontein outside Kimberley have seen rapid development of their languages. Just over a decade ago, it couldn't be written. Now there's a dictionary and some books on the way. And the clicks of the languages reverberate across the airways daily. They are paving the way for the language to become another official South African language. But there are several obstacles. The language to be introduced at our local schools, it's, it's a bad challenge, that one. So we should have to look into that one, but we don't know where to, to raise that point so that people can hear what is the need of, of the Kwei and the San people. Both Kun and Kwe communities are in the process of translating the Bible into their respective languages. The Kung community has already completed Genesis and look forward to seeing the rewards. I'm very happy that our language can now be written, but I'm even happier that we have started translating the Bible just like any other indigenous languages. The Pen South African Language Board in Northern Cape says progress is slow in recognizing Khoisan languages, but efforts are underway to preserve them. The board is contributing towards the programs with universities and experts. Other Khoisan communities also want their languages to attain official language status, but they face many challenges. The 25,000-year-old new language, for example, remains critically endangered, with only four people alive who can speak it fluently. Nama, on the other hand, is more developed and is being taught in two Northern Cape schools. Ulrich Hendricks, SABC News, Plattfontein, Northern Cape.